quick announcement before the video start. I opened commission recently, so if you like my videos, if you like my work or want to support me, please check the link in the description. And now without further ado, let's start the video. Hello everyone, my name is Kenmei and today we're going to do a summoning session on To Stay Dreaming, the new dancing banner, featuring, uh, well, genealogy of the Holy War characters. Finally we got an old um, genealogy alt banner. It's really nice to see them, well, it's going to be the main royals of the first generation, but whatever. <laughs> We finally got our Sigurd and Deirdre duo, and we got some nice art for the, all the other characters. So, let's just say I want everyone as usual. Um, in order of priority, of course the two units is going to be my first priority, because two units, and Cavalier Dancer, the first one we have. Then I guess I'd like Eklin more than Quan, even though I will also like him. Because um, we already have a lot of Landsfly... Uh, I was going to him say he was a Landsflyer, my bad. He's blue, but he's not a Landsflyer, he's a bow archer. But still, he's going to be a little bit below Eklin in my priority order. And then lastly, Lachesis. Uh She's low because let's just say that it is almost certain that we are going to have her. Four star uh, luck is a thing. So, without further ado, let's just start. Go. Okay, so a lot of chances uh, for kind of everyone. Let's start with. Let's start with the Lucky Seven. So, I wanted to wait for um, the calendar to come out, because I wanted to see how I'm going to spend orbs on the next... Uh, on, the, on this month, basically, Hello, Athena. I think I'm just going to end the sander just a little bit. I want to hear it too, you know. So, we're starting with an Athena. Uh, so, I wanted to see how much orbs or how many orbs we're going to get this month because basically um, I want to summon on the performing art banner because I do not have Olivia yet so I might drop a bit of orb tears but of course it's going to be a new summoning event a new hero summoning event um, last year this time I think it was um, I think it was uh, the banner with Bina Norn uh, Sirius which I who I do not have yet and Nagi so maybe this time around is also going to be um, mystery of the emblem banner we'll see we'll have to see hello Raisin And I hope it is one that I can skip. I, I know I uh, usually do not skip, okay, any banner, but I think I'm less going, uh, well, I'm not going to be able to summon as much as I want to this month. Okay, first circle is a bit disappointing, but whatever. We still have 200 orbs to go. And apparently she doesn't want to come. <laughs> I'd really um, like. I'd really like that. Um. Yep. Uh, hello, Moth. Oh, well, hi, Moth. So yeah. Um. I th I'm. I'm happy that we got um. A bound hero battle with Run of and Leaf and Litty Leaf. Hello, Herika. Because I still do not have the red uh, cavalier beast, so it would be nice if I managed to free summon her. I'm not going to spend on her banner, but always more chances to get her. And nothing here. Yep, Olivia. So we'll have to see. 
we are going to get the phalanx, uh, the frontline phalanx uh, event also with the with the fruit, the ivy fruit, and I knew we were. I knew I knew Imsis was going to be stingy with the uh, with the fruits, but yikes! <laughs> Three, four, two, depending on the event. Ah. That's not nice. Okay, hello Bowie. But it was to be expected, you know. Okay, so let's continue. I think I am at... Yep, three and a half. Let's go. Ooh, one made me want to come. Uh, let's start with the red. I don't know why, but I want to start with red this time. Um, in other news, we got our next resplendent. What are you doing here, Bias? <laughs> okay, um, I'm not gonna say no to this encounter or patching my. Yeah, I'm going to patch my Bias. I think he's plus defense minus HP, so exact opposite. But okay, I would have preferred the main Bias because I do not have her, but okay, first five star. Uh, let's see if we can get Alexis here. Maybe. So yeah, we, we got a new resplendent, uh, we got home, and we got a glimpse of our next resplendent, is what I want to say. And this is going to be Niffel Julia. She looks a bit strange, but I think this is a kind of uh, this is a kind of beautiful strange, in my opinion. And I'm a bit sad that I didn't guess she would be Niffel. I guessed that she would be Emblem, but... You know, her art is amazing. Her special art is amazing. Like this is this dragon is going to eat us all. Okay, thirty. Quan, do you wanna come? Maybe. But now that I think about it, I think our next resplendent will be a three and four star because we have not a lot of those. In the resplendent form. I know this is a way for this is a way to get um, to get new units. Oh, maybe she got on this one. Uh, this is a way of getting old units that are otherwise really hard to get. But that would also be nice if we could uh, get um, three and five stars. Basically. Okay, four star above. Round two. Okay. Mm -hmm. We're going to have a chance of Ethlin on this round. Uh, can we just say that he has really no luck? Like, she's riddled with super bangs. That is not funny for her. Like, why? And more... Well, even more strange, she has no super boom. Like, with so much super bangs, at least give her one super boom. <laughs> she's a landmine, basically. Uh, landmine? No, minefield. What am I saying? This is a minefield, Bane-wise. It's a bit sad for her, but that's why I hope we get two of them. And nope, this is not going to be one. Okay, so friend, oh, and a quarter. Yep, it should raise. Okay, uh, many chances of secured a bit of Laxis in one wants to get. His fair share, at least. Okay, Sylvia. Geniality! First generation! Can we get some hope? And can we get some Laxis? Like, you're a four star girl! Come here! <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. And four star. Perfect. Hmm. Um. Okay, plus res is really good on her, 
well, this is not perfect IVs because minus speed is a super bane. But this is really good IVs. I'm going to keep you, I think. Um, I'd like to get at least two more. One to pet to bane, obviously. Uh, obviously. But the thing is, uh, she has defense country at four star. And I think this is really, really impressive. I didn't think that Insis would give us a new skill as a four star so like so quickly it just came out and it's already in the four star pool like that they that's do they consider okay Cordelia do they consider cantrip skills uh, as being as bad as it, as it is because for me they can be really really useful and tricky to fight against. Useful when you use it and tricky when you have to fight against it. So I don't know. I but I I understand that in the meantime you can give air orders at four star. Okay. Uh, red as usual. So so far two units. One from the banner, another one totally unexpected. Since we were going to be... We are nearing the halfway mark. I guess this is a good time to answer some questions and you are a uh, four star, thank god. <laughs> if I get another uh, Lachesis here, I think I'll stop... Uh, ooh, I think you're, you're with the merge or the, the fodder plus defense is useless in you. But I think I'm going to answer some questions. I actually have Switzy over, oh, Switzy over here asking me a question again. Thank you, guy. Uh, so his question is: Do you have a favorite hero? And if you could add any skill to the game, what would it be? Um, I have favorite units. Uh, as usual, I can just pick one. Um. For girl units, I would say a Lynchen skill. Skill? <laughs> I wanted to say silk. What did I say? Skill. <laughs> this is bad. So, a Lynchen silk. A Lynchen is a character that I already liked before. She was one of the, of the few characters that I knew from the Fire Emblem series. And silk grew. Uh, to be one of my favorite units in Shadows of Valencia, so I love her a lot in Heroes, even though she's not uh, like the best unit in the game. And for males, uh, I'd like to say uh, that I'm just a simple girl and I like flirty boys like Inigo and Claude, even though Claude is not on the flirty side. But um, if you were to flirt with me, I would totally fall for him. Even though he might kill me in my sleep. I don't care. <laughs> I'm simping for him so hard. And if, mm, well, any girl is dance, his dance form can be useful. You have to see. I think this is the shadows. Um, the shadows videos. Who, uh, where he features. Uh, not solos, but he's putting abyssal maps with Inigo and Laszlo. And Laszlo has a really good refine, so at least uh, Inigo and Claude are both good units. Okay, Riz here. A lot of uh, Altean units. Neat. And the second part of the question is about the new skill. Well, I've been thinking about how to implement a a dancing uh, well, a dancing staff unit. And I think it would be a legendary staff special because there is no other way. It, it can't be inheritable. It would be too broken. Okay, so stop. You're from th three houses. What are you doing here? Oh, and I haven't noticed Corin. Okay, let's 
Uh, so, the skilling question would... Uh, I don't know if it would be phrases like that in this way, but it would be a special and it will grant another action to the target and all ally who cannot use refresh. And to make it so that it is not overly broken, it grants isolation to the unit for one turn. So that this is a mass refresh, but if you, if you have a dancer, you cannot just go he, uh, here and there and just refresh uh, again and again on the same turn. And it would uh, the refresh would only occur when the special triggers. So I guess that would be that would be really powerful. But I guess it would be it wouldn't be completely broken, and that could be a way to make uh, um, a healer refresher, I think. But I don't know. This this may be a really bad idea. But this is a skill I would like to see in the game. Oh, maybe Quan. Maybe Quan wants to come. I hope so. Yep. Oh, I'm building pity here. And I guess this is a time my leg ran out. Oh yeah, four and a half soon. Uh, oh, and I haven't noticed. I've been rambling for 16 minutes. I think there's going to be a moment where there's going to be a cut. Sadly. Yep. Okay, hem hammering on H, of course. I have this bad habit of just adding H's and aspiration in the beginning of my words with vowels. Okay, we get Quan. Nice. Two out of four. Um, his heart is a, uh, a bit of a underwhelming, and this is not the prettiest stat ever. But I guess we got him. And I think he was a character that, in the, um, well, in the video showing showcasing the units it was the one where where the demo was saying like yeah put sights in on him so it's a bit sad that he has less defense but we got IV mangoes god i have so many units that need one okay so i'm going to stop summoning on green i got my free axis in I was going to say, oh, she's plus B, that's so cool. She absolutely doesn't want B. Shit. Shush. I don't care. We're gonna meet Fordo. I don't know to who, but I'm going to Fordo you. That's how sad it is. And a parry to end the circle. Okay, so... For the last circles, I'm going to focus on red and colorless, I think. Just going to make a quick refresh of the recording here. And there we go. So red and colorless. And maybe blue. If there is no colorless or green or red, I'll go blue. Ethelene, come! <laughs> But why, Sakura, did you make my game bug like this? Was that a bug? I don't know. Okay, you see, girl? You wanna see your buddies? Show off your wife? Like, jeans, he's really mean to her in, the, in their conversation. I feel a bit sad to poor Deirdre. Get away! Uh, keeping my old. We're trying to get the old and everyone here. Even though I think this is not going to be the luckiest summon for me. Hey, we already got. We got four. Um, three luck. What was I going to say? Luck. It's luck kisses. Luck. Eh. 
Oh, pronunciation is going. It's bad. I'm tired. I'm stupid. Hmm. Okay, three stars are for three stars instead of three stars. I think I know what I, what this means. And after that, there will only be one circle left. Okay, Ethlyn, wanna come? You don't. It's a dancer. Not the kind of dancer we want on this banner. Why? Why, why, why? Uh, I'm not going to buy. No, I'm going to just sort my barracks and be back right away. And we're back for one last circle. So let's see what the game wants us to... Ha, to uh, uh. Well, it doesn't want to give us Sigurd. Let's see if we can get Ethlyn. To finish this off. Oh, maybe. What's it gonna be? <laughs> well, it's kind of okay because I needed to pack the vein, but... I think the one I have is also minus attack, so... Well, let's just see if Ethlyn wants to come in the same circle. Maybe? <laughs> but I can't complain too much. I've... I've gotten three, four, three five stars in 220 hours and three lacuses. So, as sad as it is, I don't think uh, this is too bad. And we are ending on a three star. Yikes. Sarah, hello. Some people really want you to get an alt one day, maybe. Um, should I go with one? One last green? Let's go with one last green. Let's see what... What's next to Bill or yeah. And a three star, okay. I'll just give me a four star to end this. And then you know. Well, we did our best this night, but... Sadly, neither the duo nor the sister didn't want to come. So we are ending at this with a Valoria and a Byleth. This is nice. But well, uh, I think my next summoning session is going to be on the new Heroes banner. If if it is about Valencia, it will. If not, uh, I think we'll see. We'll you'll see more of me on the Mythic Heroes summoning event. But well, I hope your summoning session went well. And I hope you get more luck than I did. And, well, until next time, take care of yourselves. Bye-bye!